Hey, my name's Carl. Uh, I'm a person in recovery. Um, I started playing the violin when I was three years old. By the time I was 13, uh, I got to play Carnegie Hall for the first time of six times. And when I was 15, uh, my buddies took me to see the Grateful Dead at Giant Stadium in New Jersey. And uh, the rest is kind of downhill from there. Uh, by the time I was 20, I was doing a lot of cocaine. And by the time I'd hit 30, it was cocaine, opiates, and alcohol, and kind of all of the above. Uh, it took me a lot of attempts to get to where I am today, and I have fallen a, a whole lot of times. It's really put me in touch with my own brokenness as a human being and given me a tremendous amount of compassion and, um, and empathy for what people struggle with, uh, with this disease of addiction. I used to think that, you know, coming into recovery that I had to pretend to be this guy that had it all together and that, um, you know, that, that I had to be kind of this perfect example of, of this recovered person. And uh, what I've learned through a whole lot of failures, failures on a daily basis, uh, is that I'm a human being. I make a lot of mistakes. I have figured out that through music, um, I've been lucky enough to get a gift, and uh, I need to use that gift to help people rather than to hurt people. And kind of the path that I've been fortunate enough to get on this attempt is to really channel into the service end of music. And um, there's a whole lot of people in our communities and our surrounding areas that need the gift of music that can't afford it or can't get out to see it. And so I've started working for a nonprofit out of Dallas called Music Is Our Weapon. Uh, and what we're doing is we're taking music to the elderly and to the disadvantaged. And it's a great way to give back to the community that I very freely took for from for a lot of years. I'm super grateful for everything that I have today. You know, there's a lot of people that have helped me out in this, in this recovery attempt. And I've also learned that asking for help is not a bad thing. Asking for help is probably the smartest thing I've ever done in my life. Uh, I'm super grateful that I have music and friends in my life uh, and that I get to do work like this. I mean, I really have a life beyond my wildest dreams. Mm -hmm.